Um, we did get one report that as 3i Atlas gets closer now to the sun, uh, telescopes here on Earth are picking up other objects flying alongside it. Is that accurate? Well, there are always objects. The question is whether we see unusual activity. And in fact, I tasked my research team at the Galileo project to monitor the sky for any unusual activity because it's possible that if it's a uh, alien probe uh, that in fact it would release uh, some mini probes that will visit the planets. Yeah. Which, you know, we should not assume anything. It's a blind date and we should watch the other side, you know, just in case there is a serial killer. That and we have this object with company or companions as they're putting it here. And see, as this was getting closer and backyard telescopes could start to pick up this object, we knew they couldn't keep secrets forever. People are asking questions. What are these other objects that are with it, that are trailing it and like around it? You just heard them admit this is happening. And yes, we do see rocks and clusters sometimes come with comets, but usually they have around the same composition. They're from the same ice chunk and they all look roughly the same. The image on the left, you can see there is this wild looking darker object that looks circular in the middle and almost fans out almost like wings behind this alleged comet that doesn't have any tail and doesn't look anything like a comet per everyone else's images. We've seen crazy images here as of late, all caught by people in their backyard telescopes and not the alphabet gangs. Okay, so it's showing there's something going on with this. It just so happens it's now going to be behind the sun until around December. So interesting that they wait till now and they make this comment, but the comment being there is multiple objects flying alongside 3i Atlas. Join me for the live streams going live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday where I talk about this in greater detail. Hope to see you there. Eyes to the skies.